we should be starting here in a moment. Welcome, 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 welcome. It's a marvelous Sunday. And what are we doing? We're going to play Dream. That's going to be a great time. At least, that's what I hope. We have an all new world to explore. Um, <clears throat> you know, we, we've done various fun things so far. So let's uh, let's go ahead, check out everything uh, as it's going to be in Dream. See how everything ends up. Just give me one moment. Oh, I just forgot something. You know, sometimes you forget little things. <clears throat> Hello, vicious dog. Afternoon is going absolutely wonderful. I hope you're doing great today. We're going to be diving back in. We're going to be playing Dream again. Uh, I is this the fifth time? Oh, I'll have to go back and figure that out. This might be the fifth time or the sixth time then. <laughs> that we've come to play this game. Uh, it's a whole lot of fun, and hopefully you are going to have a whole lot of fun as well in this wonderful game world. It's surreal. It's strange. Uh, there's dream landscapes. There's things to navigate. There's things to find. And... We have no idea where we might end up. So, I don't know. We're going to find out. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to hop into this game. And uh, we're going to be having... That's a really good question. Um, I know that it's available on Steam. Uh, so, I'm playing it on PC. Uh, if it's available through Steam, though, uh, that's that's a really good question. And let's actually find out really quick what I can do. Um, so... Oh, there's actually a lot of information on this. I guess they've had some console fixes. Very interesting. There, there is a lot of information I, I can see here in the Steam store. Um, they've had some console fixes. Uh, I guess it's made with the Unreal developers, uh, so it's so it's made through the Unreal Engine. And if nothing else, uh, there is. Well, they 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 feature the Oculus uh, VR. As something in the background of the game so so that is actually a great question I can't see if it's available for the PS4 I know it's available through the let's see Dream on Steam. Uh, 
Ah, oh, did it die? The only thing I can say for certain is that it is available on PC. That I can say for certain. I don't say where it's available on any other um, any other platforms or systems beyond the uh, the PC, but that doesn't mean it isn't because they had some things about console fixes and whatnot. It's available through Steam. <clears throat> recommend you go ahead look it up I'm not seeing anything but I don't have all the information for the game pulled up right now um, but we're gonna get into it and we're gonna see what's gonna happen next now the last time that I played there was um, we, we had gone ahead and we'd actually done another one of the nightmare dreams, completed that, and opened up a whole new world, uh, an island adventure. <laughs> Do not know yet how that's going to go. Not entirely certain what we're going to find there. So we're just going to have to see what's on this island world, in this island dream. Let's go ahead. As per usual, I have to <laughs> adjust the volume. Alright. So we're going to continue. Hop right back into Dream, which is available on Steam. <laughs> oh, that's funny. As per usual, every time we jump into the game, we wake up and we have to re-enter our dream state. We've gone around and we've looked around the dream world a few times. I did look up a little stuff online, but I didn't want to look up too much. I saw there's a couple people on YouTube who have like 20 part video series on going through this game. Which I can completely understand because some of these dreams are difficult to solve. Uh, I'm sure if we had like the walkthrough or the guides, you know, there's there's a lot easier ways to get through clearly. But the puzzle solving aspect is really one of my favorite things about this. Now it can get disorienting, at least for me, and there are times where you know the game does there's a little uh, anxiousness. But I guess that really depends, because it's all first person, you are alone, I've seen a few things that were a little startling, and a couple things which were like, oh. Um, but for the most part, it is a puzzle game, it is an adventure game, it's a surreal adventure. Like right now, we've just entered the dream world, this is our neutral dream space. Now, we have completed, as far as I know, we've completed Guardian Quandary, I don't know if there's anything else in there. To do the soul appraisal don't know if there's anything else in there to do and now we have ancient morality so ancient morality if we just come on in let's hop into ancient morality this is an island dream or like an island resort dream and we've been through all sorts of fun things roller coasters weird office buildings um, Nightmare recreations of our house, um, you know, oh, just some, this is more like it. yeah, so here we go, <clears throat> here's our happy holiday scenario, I'm going to wait till the dream comes into focus, because it's disorienting to just run on in. Now, the first thing I'm going to say is I've already been into this first house, this first little resort thing. Now we're on some sort of central island here, and let's just check out these other places, because the doors are unlocked. 
we want to look for uh, messages, clues, anything we can interact with. And you really want to look around a lot because sometimes you can't even see things that you can interact with until you get close enough to like touch them. So that's one. Let's go to two. <clears throat> We're going to try to open up all these areas before we move on. A cooler. Unfortunately, it doesn't look like we can take any drinks out of it. TVs we can't turn on. Luggage we can't interact with. I'm not a fan of these bathrooms in here because like just a quick starting thought there's like what appears to be a bath but where is th is this the sink is that the bath in the sink is there any toilet here is there no toilet oh dear that is unacceptable for uh, a holiday Hmm. Yep, there <clears throat> there are no toilets in this resort. So, I just want you to remember uh if you are in this resort and you have to use a toilet, sorry, not really in the cards. Now, <clears throat> we do want to try to check as many rooms as possible. We do not want to miss anything. Um, but they're looking really uniform, right? Okay, I've been in there. I guess that one's not going to open. I'm a little unhappy that we can't, uh, interact with anything in any of these rooms so I mean there's not much to be done about it it's just apparently the way the game is set up but we can't interact with most of the stuff in these rooms
It is fun, though, to be able to wander around aimlessly. I'll give it that much. You know, that's part of uh, the fun of a puzzle game, having to look everywhere for what you need. Now, I think, is this the one that we can actually... No, that's not the one. <clears throat> that's the one we can take. That room is still closed. Nice little room, isn't it? I I will say, despite the fact that there's uh, no uh, toilet in these rooms, I would stay at this resort. I guess we just have to figure some of that out ourselves. Now this is our only available path right now. This seems a bit archaic. Now that doesn't look like the portal we originally came through, so let's... Because the portal we came through is over there. So let's see if we can find our way over to that portal. What are these arrows for? You said that before, Howard, but I don't see any arrows. How do we get over there? Let's... <clears throat> I don't know, let's find our way over. There's got to be a way over to that portal. The question is how? I can see the portal. Not any way through here. Well, let's just check out all the rooms, shall we? We are looking for dream messages. We are looking for... Um, Things we can interact with, information. Oh, interesting. I wonder if they charge for lounges. Okay, I can't interact with that, but. So it's pointing right at that, but I can't interact with it. What do I have? That's really just useful in the dark, as far as I know. It doesn't have any use elsewhere in the game. I actually haven't figured out how to, what the use for most of these items is. So Howard has seen the blue arrows, he's commented on the blue arrows. We're going to have to be keenly aware that they are a puzzle of some sort. I 
<laughs> Alright. I mean, that looks like I should be able to interact with it, but I can't. blank here. Okay, that's another arrow that we can't interact with. We had one above a statue, one above a sink. There's still that portal over there that we should be able to figure out a way to get to. Good times ahead. <clears throat> there is every chance that we're going to get nice and lost in here. already been in there. Oh, and we already been down here. Oh, see, we're already lost. I'm already lost. different setup. Okay. Let's go across this bridge over here. We are trying to find a way to that other portal. Oh, did I just find a bar? Hey, look at that. Fourteen different brews on top. This might be the toughest choice I've made yet. Oh. Oh, interesting. Okay. Interesting. Maybe we pull them all down, right? What do you think? Let's see what our message is. Alright. Bar. To dream of being at a bar shows you're feeling more relaxed. It may also represent an interest in sharing stories. Drinking. To dream of drinking can serve as a metaphor of the total consumption of an experience. Take in your surroundings. Interesting. Can't use any of that.
And yes, this is the best we can do on some of these puzzles without some sort of guidance. Sometimes. Oh! Knock at the door, number four. Man alive, number five. Half a dozen, number six. Lucky number seven. Number eight, Garden's Gate. Number nine, Orders. David's Den, number ten. Legs, number eleven. And dozen, number twelve. Number thirteen, Unlucky for some. Number fourteen, The Lawnmower. Number one, Kelly's Eye. One Little Duck, number two. Cup of Tea, number three. Okay, so these are probably... Whoa. A little spaceship. Can't take it and keep it. But these all have, like, room numbers on them, so perhaps... After we just do a little more investigation. Okay. So those probably all correspond with those rooms that we've been going into. Let's just see what's up here really quick. I mean, this is a number 11, right? Okay. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, so that says down. Now, maybe we have to correspond everything with the way the arrows are pointing? Is that, could that be it? And if that is it, up, up. Okay, so this is number, what is this, number six. So we need to go back to the bar <clears throat> and have that one up. That's what I think. Let's go ahead and find out. So six should be up. that six? Let's see. Yes, okay, that was six. So that's up. Eleven is down. Let's go back up. Twelve. There's going to be an arrow in here somewhere. Up! Okay, 12 is up. 12 is up. So, that should be 12, right? Let's see. Okay, 12 is up. Okay. So let's see what number 10 is. Let's look for an arrow, arrow, arrow. Down. Look at that. So 10, I think we already have down. Can't be a hundred percent certain about that.
not seeing an arrow anywhere. Oh, there it is. Up, 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 up. So what is this one? Three is up. Should we just run all the way back over to the bar? Yes. I don't want to lose track of any of this. Three is up. Is up. All right. Okay, so this is this is our puzzle, right? Right. I hope. Number nine. Arrow, arrow, arrow. This is why there's all these rooms. Our arrow. Run the back of the door again. Well, I don't see an arrow in here. <clears throat> oh! Oh! Sneaky. Okay. Oh. So nine is up. <sighs> sneaky, sneaky. Oh. So sneaky. Three, we got three. Let's hit the other ones. Fourteen. Up. Ah. Up. Fourteen up. Sneaky, sneaky. Two. I know that there was another arrow around here. Ah! Down! Look at that. Hidden right back there. Two is down. Two is down. Right. Okay.
five. That's not the one in the bathroom. Down. Five is down. Okay. I think it's already pulled down. So, five is down. Eight. So we'll get two. We'll make sure five and eight are set. Okay, so five and eight are both down. Those should still be down from when I was just pulling all of the levers down. Oh, one is up. So one is up, seven is down. Since I already pulled them all down, we're only going to remember the ones that I need to put up. One is up. Okay. Sometimes you gotta crouch. I don't know, I'm not seeing one in this room. So we will come back, I guess. We'll come back. Don't see one in this room anywhere. Unless it's over here. Alright, so I don't see one in seven. Is this seven? Four. I don't see one in four. Okay, so let's look in thirteen.
Wow. Okay. Well, let's go back and change. I think it's number one. That one's going up. Once we get up, we will try to figure out our next step. So number four, knock, knock at the door. <clears throat> number 13, we'll just pull them both up really quick. Alright, so we have to go back and look again. So unlucky for some and knock knock at the door. Let's check it out. Let's go back to number four. Gotta go all the way over here. Okay, knock knock at the door. I honestly don't know if those are clues or what they are. Unlucky for some. Let's go over into 13. Look around again. I mean, are these things going to be somewhere really unexpected? You don't even know. But I do know that I'm not finding anything in either of these rooms. I know a couple of them are really hard to see. <sighs> I 
maybe, just maybe, because there are other rooms in, like, that main area. Could it just be that it's, it's in that starting area? Let's go over and then see if room four. Oh, do these have room numbers? Oh, these ones don't have room numbers. Unless the room numbers are on the doors. They're not. Alright. These don't come down. Alright. Back we go. Back we go. That leaves this up to a guessing game, which I don't like. So it could be a couple of different states, right? It's either You know, sometimes it's okay to guess on those last couple of things. Now, uh, what did that open up for us, though? That's the real question. Did it open another bridge to another area? It hasn't got me access to that portal yet. I'm going to assume that we now have a bridge to a new area. So let's find out. Ah, look at that. Bridge to a new area. Good, good, good. All right. Okay, so we're going to have to do the same thing, kind of do a little exploring. We have room numbers again, so let's start checking them out. Oh! These rooms are much different, aren't they? Supposed to just press a button. Oh dear. Alright. Good enough. Don't press buttons until you know what they do. Oh, there's stuff there.
Okay, so now we have a potential puzzle here. Alright. But what we really need to know is where we're going with all of our pieces before we just go ahead and send stuff anywhere. Yeah, good. I, I came through here and I just sent that back that way. Alright, getting an idea now what's going on here. Of course we have some numbers. Okay. Room 1 needs champagne. Room 4 needs burger and drink. Someone wants just sushi. Room 2 order is missing. Interesting. Here we go. Food and dreams represents the type and qualities of experiences or energy you take in your life. How certain situations are affecting you. Each food has unique experience or energy associated with it based on your opinions, feelings, or memories of the specific food. Interesting. Okay, so we have at least an idea on part of this, what we're doing. Can't tell what that is. Oh, that's the missing order, huh? Who's great idea was this hellish contraption? Management gone mad, no doubt. Sushi. Alright, so... <clears throat> I now actually have a really good idea what I'm doing. Oh, look at that. I like that. At least I have a better idea what I'm doing. Okay. Which, if I'm not mistaken, is trying to maneuver these orders to the appropriate rooms. So let's go back down because we need to see exactly what's going where. Pardon me. Okay. Room 1 needs champagne. Room 4 needs burger and drink. Room 2 order is missing. Uh, wants just sushi. So this is kind of straightforward. We need to get champagne to room 1. And that's our first task. Right? At least that's what I think. Which means we're going to need to get everything out of the way. We're going to have to find where the champagne is, which I think is all the way over here. And let's see what this room is. So that's room. So what we need... Where's the champagne? No, the champagne's not there. Okay, so... What we're going to do first... I should move that there. Uh, we're going to have to go down and make sure nothing's in the way before we try to pass it along. Get 
get that out of the way and we're gonna go ahead and Can't move that one. Okay, that's good enough. We can at least move the champagne down to room two. Right? Right. Sent that down, good. Now let's get all the way to room one and make sure nothing's in the way. Oh, I bet something will be in the way. Okay, so that's the sushi for someone. <sighs> okay. I think it's that room four wants the burger. No, oh, I can't do that from here. Let's see if there's anything in the way over here. There it is. Or something. Okay, I'm gonna have to move that all the way down. They do like to have some interesting puzzles. So the beer tap puzzle was pretty easy. Well, not easy so much as it wasn't difficult to figure out. Maybe that's just my perception. I'm sure I'll change my mind very soon. Send that down there. Oh my goodness. Okay, move the sushi there for now.
get that out of the way, and then I should be able to send the burger all the way down. Assuming I'm doing this right. That's gonna go down. Let's see. If there's anything in the way. Nothing in the way. So that's there. Now let's see if I'm doing this right so far. Room one. Burger and drink. Okay. Room one needs the champagne. Let's send it all the way down. Oh my goodness, what is wrong? <sighs> this is why you make sure to not get confused. So let's make sure that we can put it in room number one, which we currently cannot. All right. <clears throat> Just to be safe, let's get both of those orders. Oop, nope, I was the wrong button. One thing I do know is I need that out of there. I need that out of there. that out of there. And 
get that out of there. Okay, now I have to figure something. Okay, so room one has the champagne, room four has the burger. Room three has to want the sushi. That's all I can imagine. Or no one wants just sushi. Is that it? Is that why it's stricken off? Order is missing. Okay. Let's just take a look here real quick. So we got a burger there. We need a drink over here. Yes. So other than the champagne, do we have any other drinks? I don't think so. Looks like fancy food. But those drinks, those are drinks that we can't set. Okay, so we need to get something out of the way. So it won't let me press that other button.
Hmm. Well, we have a lot to still figure out, but we made progress. That's what I'll say. We made progress. We don't know who just wants sushi. Maybe it's no one. Room two order is missing. Burger and drink for four. Champagne for one. We're going to get this all sorted out. Don't know if we're going to be doing that today. But. Oh. I know I've had a lot of fun. And I hope you've had a lot of fun too. I will say. I'm, I'm, I'm enjoying all of. These. Returns to dream. And if you're interested in watching all the previous streams, they have been reposted on uh, YouTube at Robot Queen Studios. So I would like to thank you very much for being here today. Uh, I wish you the best weekend. <laughs> and I would like to thank you tremendously for being here with me tonight. Thank you so much. You have... A most wonderful remainder of your day, remainder of your weekend, and uh, take care. Be excellent, my friends. Thank you so much for being here, by the way. <laughs> and I will see you all again very soon. Oh my goodness. I, I had a lot of fun, though. We, we made it through one puzzle for this level, and I call that a pretty good day. Take care. Be excellent. Bye, everyone.